a uh, two-page report, a letter from the Governor General, Julie Payette. And this is just part of it. Uh, she says, everyone has the right to a healthy and safe work environment, she begins, at all times and under all circumstances. It appears this was not always the case at the office of the Secretary to the Governor General. Tensions have arisen at Rideau Hall over the past few months, and for that, I am sorry, she writes. Well, no formal complaints or official grievances were made during my tenure, which would have immediately triggered a detailed investigation as prescribed by law and the collective agreements. I still take these allegations very seriously, she writes. Not only did I welcome the review of the work climate at the um, Governor General, but I repeatedly encouraged employees to participate uh, in the review in large numbers. We all experience things differently interesting phrase there, but we should always strive to do better and be attentive to one's perceptions. I'm a strong believer in the pre principles of natural justice, but she says, I've come to the conclusion that a new governor general should be appointed. Canadians, she writes, deserve stability in these uncertain times. She also says, from a personal side, the decision comes at an opportune time, as my father's health has seriously worsened in the last few weeks and my family needs my help. So it is with sureness and humility, and also with pride over what was accomplished during my tenure and in my service to the country in 28 years that I've submitted my resignation. I have informed the Prime Minister of Canada of my decision. I wish him the best as he seeks an individual to recommend to Her Majesty as the next Governor General, and I wish the best to my successor. And then she goes on to say what a privilege it has been. This is an extraordinary letter, and I, and I just want to go over this quickly. Tensions have arisen at Rideau Hall over the past few months, and for that, I'm sorry. So she openly apologizes. It has been significantly longer than the past few months, and we'll go over the controversies that have plagued the three years and three months of the tenure of Julie Payette. She says no formal complaints or office grievances were made during her tenure. But there had been... Uh, an internal investigation and internal workplace surveys done that Rideau Hall had been among the worst places to work in the government. 